We are staying at Glacier Haven RV Resort. And uh, what we've learned is to check in, you can pull in, and, but the problem is usually nobody's there because they also run the cafe. So if you're coming in from the east, the cafe, you're going to pass the cafe before you get to the pull in. But anyway, we'll just kind of take a quick drive through. And uh, of course, if you're coming from the west, then just stop up here that says in cafe. That's right here. That's the end. And here's the cafe here, or bar and grill. I call it cafe. And then you're just going to come down here just a little bit to the next driveway. And you'll see the sign. Don't get confused with this one. It's not this one. It's the one on the south side of the road. But we chose this place because they are probably better than less than half the rate that everybody else. They're less than half of what everybody else is charging because we stayed here for about 500 and how much Brenda 568 568 and some of these places like KOA and uh, was quoting over $1,200 for a week and we did it for uh, 1268 or uh, 568 and all their sites are uh, marked Uh, full hookups, 30, 50 amp, water, sewer. They do have internet. I'm not going to say it's high speed internet, but when you check in, they'll give you the password for it. Uh, you tell them what size rig you have because some of the sites are just enough for small. They have a restroom and they, a laundry mat. They have uh, showers. showers. And where it says wide turn, believe me, with our 43 foot, we needed all the wide turn we could get out of it. But uh, it's quiet here. I mean, quiet. You got the road on one side and the trains on the other, but hey, we're gone most of the day. We're so tired at night. I don't, it doesn't really bother me. Anyway, uh, there's our rig right here. And it, it works. We're out of the truck now, and that's the cabins that they rent. Here's our site here. I'll go over the next site, you can kind of see. We're in site 13, here's site 15. And you've got a picnic bench. Water, power, and of course the sewer back here, a little white cap. And you've got a little fire pit back here. It's a nice, nice area. You've got the train running over there in the distance.